Hello, welcome to One Minute Wiser. This is Christy Bridges, and this morning I was reading Joshua 24. I thought I'd share it with you. So Joshua, in verse 22, says to the people, You are witnesses against yourselves. You're making a commitment that you have chosen the Lord to serve him. And they said, Oh, we are witnesses. He said, Well, then put away all the foreign gods that are in your houses and incline your heart to the Lord, the God of Israel. Verse 31 says, Israel served the Lord all the days of Joshua and all the days of the elders who outlived Joshua and had known the work of the Lord did for Israel. These people were the children of the slaves God led out of Egypt with a pillar of fire, parting the waters getting water for them out of rocks and feeding them with nothing. And yet they had idols in their house already, a generation later. Why do we do that? We look back and Adam went through the same thing. Adam knew God, was made by God, but by the time he passed away, it was only a couple decades before God had to wipe the earth clean with the flood and start over with Noah because people had gotten so rotten. We treat God transactionally. We say, well, you did something amazing for someone else, but you haven't done it for me. So I'm not going to believe you're real. I'm going to seek other things. And that makes us miserable. And it's kind of silly and shallow. Jesus came so we could have a relationship with God. Relationship is what made Moses' life different. It's what made Joshua's life different. It's what worked for Adam and Noah, we can have that same kind of relationship that goes beyond transaction. God bless you guys today.